Hello, I just got my DJ Dow controller in the other day, popping music to be exact, and uh, wow, I was surprised on just how high quality this thing is, like, it lights up and it feels and looks pretty arcade accurate. From, my, from what I've heard, the buttons do get stuck after a little bit, but um, they haven't got stuck yet. I've been playing mainly 44s and 45s on the new scale, and uh, they haven't got stuck yet, but I'm sure they probably will in the future. <laughs> um, wow, I was just amazed in how arcade accurate this was compared to the uh, original green arcade style controller and even the premium model. So wow, I'm gonna go ahead and do some gameplay. So if y'all want to stick around for that, I'll play two songs probably. Um, and just see, I mean not see, and just show y'all how it looks. Are you ready?
And as you just saw, if you uh, watched, if you made it through the two videos, uh, it plays really good. It plays really well. Um, I'm just amazed at how arcade accurate this is. Uh, and I don't even have the sand wall buttons. These are stock buttons. So, um, yeah, honestly, I don't know which one to recommend. The DJ Dow or the premium model because the premium model has the good looks. It looks really good, but you can't do PlayStation. This, you can do PlayStation and PC. So, honestly, well, actually, the DJ Dow is a lot cheaper. I paid like 600 for my premium model. And I paid 400 for this. Um, so I guess going by price rise, I would say the DJ Dow because you get PlayStation um, PlayStation cord to go with it, or well, that's attached to it. And uh, and from what I heard, these are very easy to mod. So you really can't mod the premium model, but the premium model is still a really good model. But I just wanted to test out the DJ Dow. So thanks for watching.